A lot of people ask me why the tagline for Cooper Osborne Golf is catch it on the rack. Well, recent 3D analysis of good golf swings shows that the hands and arms on the downswing reach their lowest point somewhere in front of the right leg, while the club head is still fairly far away from the ball. And by the time the club head strikes the ball, the hands and arms are beginning to rise, or they are rising. So a good golfer literally catches the ball with his golf club as his arms are rising. Much like a tennis player catches a ball on the rise for a top spin for him. Now, some of your greatest ball strikers of all time and of current time do not take very deep divots. And some like Harry Varden and Jack Nicholas and Tom Watson uh, barely took a whisper of a divot on many of their shots. Now the only way to catch the ball on the rise is to have a mechanically advantaged relationship between your leading arm and club through the ball. And then, like a hockey player, you can send a puck along the ice. You catch the puck on the rise of your hand. Now, when you can learn to do that, you'd be amazed at how contact with the ball improves. And the, even though the hands are beginning to move upward, the club is still going a little downwards or level to the ground through the ball. So learn to catch it on the rise for better content and less stress on the body.